All right, today I'm checking out Snuffbox. I'm listening to Boyfriend Sketches. Let's get into it. Can I help you with that? Are you sure? Absolutely. My lady is in distress, and I'm here to rescue her. Thanks. They say chivalry's dead, but I think you're making a pretty strong case for its revival. Well, I'm always ready to help a uh, beautiful lady. I help the ugly ones as well, but I definitely say you're in the former camp. <laughs> Where am I taking this? Well, it's only a few streets away. I'm moving in with my boyfriend. Fuck you. Oh! Hello there. <laughs> you must what? be Quick Finch's granddaughter. <laughs> you're much better looking than he is. Imagine trying to kiss that. <laughs> <laughs> They look heavy. Let me take these to your table. Thank you, handsome. Um, the gin and tonics for my sister, Ruth. Okay. This one is for Stacey. Hello. And if you could hand this one to my boyfriend. Fuck you. Whiskey! <laughs> <laughs> look at that woman over there. Savage. No, you <laughs> by the estate agents. What, the woman? Mm. Well, she wants to buy a house. You're so naive. Are you still reading those women's magazines? Yeah. Yeah. You see, where you see champagne, I see p She clearly wants to be picked up. <laughs> what makes you such an expert? I wasn't made an expert. I was born one. Watch this. So why would a beautiful woman like you be looking at flats in a neighborhood like that? <laughs> Monjolese 2's FM. What does that mean? It means why put bay windows on a shit house? <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, a woman as beautiful as you will be living in Kensington Gardens. Really? You think so? I don't think so. I know so. That's exactly what my boyfriend was saying the other day. Fuck you. <laughs> This is just so stupid, it's funny. You know, now I even know what's coming. The surprise is how does it end? Now you know it's gonna be the person mentioning they have a boyfriend. Now it makes sense, it's called boyfriend sketches. It's like you know what's coming. If you can know what's coming and they still make you laugh, that's crazy. You know what I mean? That's really good. It's like, how is this gonna end? You can't predict that he's gonna take something and throw it through a car window. It's so insane and so over the top. Like you're not gonna see this in real life, hopefully, but people have done crazier things than this yeah things unspeakable things unspeakable things when they're trying to mate and stuff people have literally shot people for uh, getting rejected like a girl rejected a guy he shot her you know this, this, like the craziest stuff happens way crazier than this so this actually could happen now that i think about it but for normal people you know for people who are not mentally ill then this is over the top that's why it's so funny now how is this one gonna end got a dog one of the dogs is the boyfriend's dog or something let's see Hello there, beautiful. Oh, hello. Chris, uh, I guess I needed a shorter lead. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> You're such a gentleman. Well, it has been said that I'm a gentleman, but never a gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> Can I accompany you on your journey? <laughs> He's sure. a savage. I've got to get Scruffy back to my boyfriend and then I'll fuck you. <laughs> Quite an enigma, sir. Really? We have walked almost two miles, and yet you have spoken but three words. Hmm. If I were bolder, I'd say you were in love, sir. Ah, a swing! How charming! You made this, didn't you, Master Berry? I would be honoured if my lady were to christen the rope folly I have erected. <laughs> Oh, yes. <laughs> I say, over here. Sir, it's Rupert. Look, on the horse. Yoo-hoo! Hello. A friend of yours, I presume? My fiancé. Fuck you! Ah! What? What? How are you going to end it on that one? How are you gonna end it on that one? They had a lot stronger ones. Everyone other than that last one was very strong. Very strong. Like, I was wondering, like, what's he gonna do to this last lady? 
in that position. I don't know. Do you like throw her off the swing or something? So I guess he pushed her so hard that she flew off somewhere. Very over the top. The one before that, the dog, the dog one was so fast. You know what I mean? You didn't even really have time to guess, oh, what's going to happen other than it's probably her boyfriend's dog. I thought those were both her dogs and one was the boyfriend. You know what I mean? You don't even have time to guess. They start talking, boom, instantly. Boyfriend, kick the dog out. To, I think my eyes were closed because I was laughing. Kick the dog. And then he goes and kicks the other guy's dog like that. That may have been my favorite one. It's just amazing that you can make people laugh even though they know exactly what's coming. You know exactly what's coming here. Girl mentioned she has a boyfriend. That's the whole thing. But then they even had you laughing before it got to the punchline because he had just some funny pickup lines. And, I'm a gentleman. It's been said, I'm a gentleman, but never a gentle man. You know what I mean? Like kind of corny dad joke humor. But also he was just so confident in his delivery that I don't know. That was a good one. That was pretty funny. I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. Where did it go? She told me, boy, you to go. Like, I don't know. But I don't know.